alone again. I wonder if anyone besides me is going to survive this shit. Although, there has to be, since there's a sequel. I think there are actually two sequels. The thing, the reason I didn't really mention the Pier 3 is that I, I haven't actually seen it being sold anywhere. So, I wonder what, what it's all about. It did go pretty well. Any odd looking boxes? A lot of unnatural corridors that basically go S-shaped constantly. These they don't feel like actual buildings anymore. There's just a storage area, then these weird hallways, then probably another storage type area.
Okay. Things not to do. The fuckers teleport. back for extra health. Rocket launcher. I don't know. You, this is a good basic weapon. This is a good sniping weapon. So you would want something extra. This is a bit too much like a standard machine gun for our assault rifle. So I guess we'd go for a rocket gun. This one is particularly good. The core game, in my opinion, it, it it has too few shots. It basically has thirty in total. I'll take it this time. But this is probably where we have to come to. But uh, see if there's something interesting down here. Thank <laughs> you. 
I'll survive a grenade. There are too many explosive containers. Oh. It's a turret. Yep. It, it doesn't matter. If I throw a grenade anywhere, I'm going to take more damage from it than they are. It's an awful, awful position to be in. There are so many explosive containers there. There are two pathways and it's completely in the dark. The distance is also so great that uh, I can't reliably kill things with the assault rifle at that distance. I'd have to stay put and defend a the location they're gonna chuck a grenade at anyway. So, I'm not sure what the best alternative there is. I don't think I can just go in and blast everything unless I use the heavy weapon, which is not how you use heavy weapons. You don't have. I need a grenade soon. At least one more. Hoping they'll come from the rear. The wall fix itself. Can't see shit.
I have no idea if the hostiles are to the left or to the down, so no idea. But I'm hesitant to just go in there and try to see what happens. I don't think I have much of a choice soon. all that well. But still we are alive. And this sort of turret use I can get behind. Lack of light was the problem this time. Just I have no idea what the area was like. We get a mine back, so nothing lost. That seems to be a fairly reliable thing. Then, when you when the game puts you in a really bad position like that, it also fairly often, at least, provides a uh, resources to get through it. Still, it only gave back one. Can't go wasting those. Offering heavy weapons here, various types. Assuming something uh, a little bit more heavily armored is coming our way soon. Checkpoint. This would be the point, I guess. Take it on. If we use the rocket launcher, it's not going to be enough. I want to go there, though. Full ammo on for this weapon. Thirty shots. Okay, the armor has to break through there. 
Otherwise, this makes no sense. So if I move there, I'm gonna get my balls busted by the heavy armor. I think it's gonna happen no matter where I go. No, there's only one path. Right. Gonna burst through. There's no other choice. This full ammunition from the rocket can, can, gun can be used to kill one of those. I used a couple of grenades plus half my ammo and I killed one. I just... The weapon is theoretically, I think, okay, but... Uh, practical terms, I, it, it, it is not, not. Not at all. I just don't like it. Ah, I'm still keeping it for now. Come on. Yes, I am. The thing is, it it's it has too little ammunition to use against the weaker heavy armor things. Not these robotic things, but the weaker ones. So, the penetrator can be used against those. And grenades are a viable weapon against heavier ones. Added with some penetrator shooting and that usually does the job just fine. So, I, I don't know. I feel... I bitched about this quite a bit, but the three weapon uh, selection is that that's a big mistake. Funnels you to play the game the same way. Unless you are looking for a challenge or something like that. I sort of don't understand the pistols either or the Melee, it's 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 not like it's ineffective. It's just why? How would you realistically use that? Unless you go camping beside around corners or something, taking down four or five guys quickly with the me uh, melee can't be easy. You just don't have enough time with the slow mo. Looks like there's probably enemies lurking from below there. So we get a little bit closer. No? Must go. You have made your way through the warehouse district and into the city subway system. 
The subway system connects to the medical district downtown. Jin San Kwan is ahead, waiting, alone. Mission. Head down through the subway terminal and onto the subway tracks. Follow the tracks toward the medical center. So, wonder if there's a threat to being run over by the subway. And you're so just supposed to fight there. Grenades and other explosives can temporarily stun enemies, giving you a few, a few seconds to get the drop on them. 